Hello there and welcome back. If you're a fan like me, you'll agree that Green Acres 1965 stands among the greatest TV series ever. So, how about joining me today? Grab a chair, settle by the campfire, and let's relive this fantastic show together. We'll journey through the entire cast, past and present, reminiscing about those who've left us and celebrating those who still shine. Ready? Let's dive in and rekindle some incredible memories. Eva Gabor played the character Lisa Douglas in the TV series when she was 46 years old in 1965. July 4, 1995 was a tough one. She left us due to respiratory failure due to complications of a fall at 76 years old in Los Angeles, California. It's a sad loss for all of us. You're talking Hungarian and she's talking Spanish and you understand each other? Of course. Oh, it's impossible. Oh, now you're against the legs, antlers, legs. And I said, I got to do something to look different. And I dashed home and I got a negligee. And you know that long thing you sprinkle on a turkey? Tom Lester played the character Eb Dawson. He was 27 years old when the TV series ran in 1965. It's with a heavy heart that I've got to tell you that on April 20th, 2020, he left us after complications from Parkinson's disease at 81 in Nashville, Tennessee. We're really filling the loss. I'm sorry, no more playing that radio while we're working. But Mr. Douglas, I... May I remind you that good jobs are hard to find. I know, that's why I took this one. That's the age group that's buying the majority of the products. But as I travel around and, and all across the country, and I'm somewhere almost every weekend in a different part of America. Pat Buttram played the character Mr. Haney in the TV series when he was 40 years old in 1965. Sadly, on January 8, 1994, he left us due to kidney failure at the age of 78 in Los Angeles, California. His passing deeply saddens us. Campbell. Well, I've heard he has a certain animal attraction. Well, I've never seen no dogs running after him. <laughs> it ain't that kind of attraction. On these guys, yeah. so they, 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 they do I things. said to him, I said, how do you get them to dance in time with the music? And he said, if they're dancing too slow, I turn up. <laughs> Alvy Moore played the character Hank Kimball. He was 44 years old when the TV series ran in 1965. May 4, 1997 was a tough one. He left us due to heart failure at 75 years old in Palm Desert, California. It's a sad loss for all of us. For up to the minute weather information. You just pick up the phone and call me, and I'll give you the latest scientific forecast. You have a weather station? No, an almanac. Mr. Bush. Uh... Two naturals coming up. You know, people ask for Anheuser-Busch natural light a lot of different ways. But around here, we just say natural. Eddie Albert played the character Oliver Wendell Douglas in the TV series when he was 59 years old in 1965. It's with a heavy heart that I've got to tell you that on May 26, 2005, he left us after pneumonia at 99 in Pacific Palisades, Los Angeles, California. We're really filling the loss. Need a photo now? <laughs> I'm an American. Oh. <laughs> Things must have been very bad with your father. Oh, no. I'm married. You don't think I see through you? You could wear two wool sweaters and a raccoon coat. I'd still see through you. I've never once... Frank Caddy played the character Sam Drucker. He was 50 years old when the TV series ran in 1965. Sadly, on June 8, 2012, he left us due to a heart attack at the age of 96 in Wilsonville, Oregon. His passing deeply saddens us. Not an old male. Here you are. <laughs> now, for the benefit of those who have never witnessed an old male day ceremony, I'd like to explain just... Oh, uh, yes, is the mail in. There ain't any mail, Mr. Douglas. Why not? Well, you see, me and Cos Conway, he's a postmaster up in Pixley. Yeah. We had a little falling out, and he says... Hank Patterson played the character Fred Ziffel in the TV series when he was 76 years old in 1965. August 23, 1975, was a tough one. 
He left us due to bronchial pneumonia at 86 years old in Woodland Hills, Los Angeles, California. It's a sad loss for all of us. Dave is deer hunting. But I don't want to do away with deer hunting. Oh, but Mr. Ziffer, if you would only read the reasons. Well, let's see what they are. No, what they do. This is going to be a big night for me. It is? What's going to happen? You'll find out. Good evening, folks, and welcome to the... Mary Grace Canfield played the character Ralph Monroe. She was 41 years old when the TV series ran in 1965. It's with a heavy heart that I've got to tell you that on February 15th, 2014, she left us after lung cancer at 89 in Santa Barbara, California. We're really filling the loss. English downstairs maid. <laughs> Sire, there's a telephone call for you. Thank you. Where's the telephone? Oh, Gomer. They're beautiful. I'm sorry I missed the other. Sid Melton played the character Alf Monroe in the TV series when he was 48 years old in 1965. Sadly, on November 3, 2011, he left us due to pneumonia at the age of 94 in Burbank, California. His passing deeply saddens us. That's it. Resort to violence. What's all the yelling about? You know what's been going on between my brother and your husband? What? Nothing. Ralph, will you... Barbara Pepper played the character Doris Ziffel. She was 50 years old when the TV series ran in 1965. July 18, 1969, was a tough one. She left us due to coronary thrombosis at 54 years old in Panorama City, California. It's a sad loss for all of us. Just my luck you had to move in. Brad, if you don't want to go, just say so. I don't want to go. <laughs> he said that about our first honeymoon. Well, where did you go? All right, let's chat. Who's your absolute favorite character from Green Acres 1965? Jump into the comments and spill the beans below this video. And as usual, show some love. Hit that like button, subscribe for more, and ding that notification bell to never miss my new stuff. I can't wait to cook up more fantastic memories with you. Thanks a bunch, and stay tuned for more. See you all soon.